it's the bane of every teen's existence. After sitting through hours at school, they leave only to get started on mountains of homework. And educators are mixed on its effectiveness. Some say the practice reinforces what students learn during the day, while others argue that it put unnecessary stress on kids and parents who are often stuck nagging or helping. According to a new study conducted by the Better Sleep Council that homework stress is the biggest source of frustration for teens, with 74% of those surveyed ranking it the highest, above self-esteem, 51%, parental expectations, 45%, and bullying, a 15%. Get push notifications with news, features and more. Follow following you'll get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notifications. Homework is taking up a large chunk of their time too, around 15 plus hours a week, with about one third of teens reporting that it's closer to 20 plus hours. The stress and excessive homework adds up to lost sleep, the BSC says. According to the survey, 57% of teenagers said that they don't get enough sleep, with 67 reporting that they get just 5 to 7 hours a night, a far cry from the recommended 8 to 10 hours. The BSC says that their research shows that when teens feel more stressed, their sleep suffers. They go to sleep later, wake up earlier, and have more trouble falling and staying asleep than less stressed teens. We're finding that teenagers are experiencing this cycle, where they sacrifice their sleep to spend extra time on homework, which gives them more stress, but they don't get better grades," said Mary Helen Rogers, the Vice President of Marketing and Communications for the BSE. Another interesting finding from this study, students who go to bed earlier and wake up earlier do better academically than those who stay up late, even if those night owls are spending the time doing homework. To end this cycle of sleep deprivation and stress, the BSC recommends that students try setting a consistent time to go to sleep each night, regardless of leftover homework. And their other sleep tips are good for anyone, regardless of age, keep the temperature between 65 and 67 degrees, turn off the electronic devices before bed, make sure the mattress is comfy, and reduce noise with earplugs or sound machines.